uh, in this video, we are going to talk about the print function of the Power Platform. So this is the shopping cart app that I created in my last video. And what we can do here is I can add to cart and I can place an order. So what I want to do is I want to take a print screen of this particular app so that I can print it or I can save it as a PDF. So for that, what we can do is we can put an icon. You can also place it in the button, but here is a print icon here. So why not use this one? So here I have my print icon, which I put it here. Okay, so with this print icon, what I'll do is I'll just type print. With this, you get a printing feature here, which uh, print the screen in the A4 size. So let's print it out. Now you can see this has been printed, uh, but you can still see there is a bit of space here. And if it's in portrait mode, then the space is again, a lot bigger. Uh, in some cases, you might not see these images if your background graphics is not turned on and it might look something like this. So this is just needs to be turned on. And now since uh, it does not exactly fit in the screen, what you can do is there is a layout for the printing purpose. So if you have a screen that you want to have an exact print of, you can use either of these. For this demo purpose, I'll just use the landscape print one. So now what I'm going to do is I'll just copy all of these and put it here. Just make some small adjustments. Now let's see how this one goes. I like till end, till corner. So you also get this uh, print label automatically, which I can just put it in front of this print icon. And if you see uh, it's on select, it, it has the same code. Right. Now let's play this and print this. And since it's in portrait mode and our screen is in landscape, so we have to switch our layout and it's like, uh, exactly fits now, another thing is when printing out the screen we might not want uh, these button to be visible so what we can do is we can go to its visible option and put a code that checks uh, if the screen is in printing mode or not so the condition is if uh, the name of the screen is screen 2 so screen 2 dot printing so this check whether the screen is in printing mode or not if it's in printing mode i don't want it to be visible if it's not you can show it okay all good now let's play this and this button is no more visible now uh, you can just simplify this code and do it something like this so wrap it around And I put an exclamation at the start. And it acts uh, in the same way that it acts if you put a if condition and put the uh, other stuff. So let's click this and it's not visible again. But over here, it's sorry, over here, it's visible. So that's how you can implement the print functionality in your Power Apps. Thank you so much for watching my video. If you want to see more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel and click the bell notification. Thank you so much.